It's a monkey mystery that had police chasing their tails. Oh my God. Like hunting Bigfoot with a smaller shoe size. For hours, I was just shook because that's not something that you see every single day. Sammy Trent and Lucky Griffith say they knew no one would believe they saw monkeys in Price Hill. That's why we instantly pulled out cameras and stuff because it doesn't even sound believable. They were swinging from the trees. Hey, there's one down below you. This is the video they shot. They say it shows three monkeys in the trees. They say there were at least two more on the ground that you can't see. The grainy images were taken at about 10 last night. The last time a group of monkeys got this much TV time, they were making jokes and playing guitar. We, at first we thought they might have been possums or something, but then we seen them actually swinging from the trees like monkeys, and we were like, oh, those are monkeys for real. If it's a hoax, it's also a conspiracy because Lucky and Sammy aren't the only ones who say they saw the monkeys. So did this woman. I was standing right here. It was standing right there by the garbage can. She lives just down the street from where the video was taken. Taller than the garbage can, and it, its arms were real long, like hanging down like this, and its arms were real skinny. The monkeys were spotted near the St. Joseph Cemetery, where the monkeys were clearly not following the rules. No one is missing monkeys, and no one knows where they went, unless they caught the last train to Clarksville. Now this whole idea sounds like something out of a Curious George book, right? But there is a serious side to this. You know, large primates can be very, very dangerous, so keep that in mind. Reporting live, Brian Hemrick, WLWT News 5. Yeah, a story like this comes along, and Brian's at the meeting table. He says, I got this one. <laughs> uh, Brian, any idea about where these monkeys would have come from? Well, the zoo says they didn't come from the zoo. They're not missing any monkeys. You know, there was some talk that maybe some private person owned monkeys around here, but really, Mike, no one knows for sure. All right, Brian Hamrick on the case for us on the monkey mystery tonight. Thank you so much.